Now, on Thursday morning, I attended the national emergency briefing in London, and the message across the board is that the environmental breakdown is escalating faster than expected. Now, one of the other speakers was Lieutenant General Richard Nuji, a retired former general from the British Army. He spoke about the threat of climate change to national security. He said, we're facing the possibility of an ungovernable state. And he mentioned Churchill in his uh, presentation. Now, afterwards, I asked him a bit more about that. And he said Churchill called out the threat that we faced at the start of the Second World War. He, yeah. he named the threat and he faced it. Churchill did two things. One is he called it out, out of government, very unpopular, people didn't trust him, and yet he called it out time and time and time again. So that when the crisis really hit in 1940, you had an individual who was not moving from what he had said before he was in power, before he had the ability to actually change anything, he was turning around and saying, we need to persevere. The other thing he did is he had a constant belief that we could win, that we could do it, that we could provide hope for everybody, that even in the worst time of the Blitz, that actually we will get through this and we will survive and we will prevail. That sort of leadership is not there today. Who's our Churchill now?